Hey guys, welcome back. Okay, so in the previous episode, basically what we did was we made... We, we started off by picking up a few audio logs, but essentially we made our way to... Um, Threeto Huadiv. So the overriding question at this point is, does he have three toes all together, or three toes on each foot? We don't know. Um, there's also... Uh, vantage point just to our south, which I would like to pick up as well while we're here. Um, we don't need this marker anymore. Let's get rid of it. Um, so yeah, that's basically what we did last episode. We made our way to this guy. So now we're here. Let's go ahead and have a word with him. Hey, my friend. You're three to Hwadiv, right? Vanasha sent me. What happened? I got hornswoggled, that's what. Vanasha batted her lashes, wiggled her hips, and promised us treasure. Clear a path for the royals, she said. Sneak past the garrison and skewer a few watches. Hardly a bother. Little did we know there was a damned monstrosity lurking underground. When will I learn not to gawk at skinny girls? Oh, no. Vanasha? Why do you think Vanasha swindled you? My crew came to Sunfall because we heard the bounties were fat. She offered us the fattest one of all, enough to retire on. It's my own damned fault for taking the bait. Should have known I'd end up with a rupture in my useful pots. Clear a path. So Vanasha needed safe passage for Nasadi and Idaman, but it didn't work out? She made it sound so sweet and easy. Find the best path to the lake, make sure it's safe. What could go wrong? Turns out, a lot. Like... Bloody murder in the grinding jaws of a heinous death beast. Monstrosity? Something attacked you from underground. Oh, you picked yep. that up, did you? A rock breaker. I wondered why the Shadow Kaja didn't pay attention to the pass. Well, they don't need to. A rock-eating demon guards it for them. It tunnels in the dirt, breaks through the earth, and blasts rocks from its stinking face. I barely escaped. My comrades weren't so lucky. I might shed a tear if they weren't all cutthroats and cheaters. Okay, we gotta take it on anyway. Vanasha will be here soon with Nasadi and Idaman. I've got to destroy that thing in the past before they arrive. You're not too bright, are you? Well, we didn't last long against it, but I'll tell you what I know. It has armor everywhere, a little less at the rear. And when it goes underground, it will lose track of you if you're quiet. You might even be able to keep it from going under altogether if you hit its big crooked arms hard enough. That's all I can offer, friend. I promise to look solemn at your funeral before I hit the bar. Damn. How many bombs do I have? Not a whole lot. All right, we're gonna have to kill the rock breaker. Son of a gun. Yep, there he is. Oh, he saw me. He saw me. That wasn't a safe point. <laughs> I hate rock breakers. I hate them. I hate them. I hate them. Yeah. Well, I mean, I took on two. Of course, kind of cheesed it when I did it. Come on now. Oh boy. Well, I've heard him.
Come on. Oh, you bastard. Yeah! Die, fool! I'll find a use for you. What you got on you? Give me all your good stuff. Please. A couple of coils that I really would like to take. Um, but again, I don't have space for. All right. Uh, modifications. What do I have that's useless? 8% damage coil. That's not useful. 10% damage coil. Also not useful. Um, handling, 16%. 17%. Take get rid of those. 5%. No. No. Um... All right, that's pretty good. I got some room. Very cool. Um, speaking of that, what have I got on you? 62% handling. Okay, you're fine. Uh, what else do I have here? Where's the rest of my weapons? What have you got on you? Extra damage. Let's see. Um, it's currently 43%. No, that's as good as it's going to get. All right, well, we'll leave it. Okay, uh, what about, actually, what about my armor? I haven't messed with this in a while. Resist melee attack weave. 12%. Resist fire. I'll resist ranged. Alright. Dust feels like it's under my skin. Good enough. Uh took care of that little problem. Where's what's his face? Hey, what's your face? Took care of your little rock breaker for you. I'm well, getting this guy's a pain in the butt, isn't it? Okay, I took care of him. Are you impressed? Son, I can't believe it. I thought that evil rock jewel would grind you up. Yeah, it takes more than a rock record to grind me up. After that miracle, all we can do is wait. Vanasha will be here soon, along with a boat that'll take the royals across the lake. Oh, I guess we're just waiting. Fair enough. Ah, little Huntress. Glad you accepted my invitation to play bodyguard. Where are you men, Eve? It looks like something chewed you up and spat you out. That's pretty much exactly what happened. The way is clear. Can we go? I like how you always cut to the chase. In this case, literally. It won't be long before we're followed. Don't be afraid, your radiance. We've got excellent protection. Sure. I guess it's just the, the four or five of us. What do I gotta do? Get into the boat? Uh 
Uh oh, they're coming. Oh dear. Here come the Shadow Carter, and they're very angry with me. I'll hold them off. Very noble of you, but when I start a fuss, I like to finish it. Not that your assistant isn't welcome. Khwadiv, get Itaman and his mother to the shore. Carefully. All right, we're holding off the so Shadow Carja. This. I must say, after two years under the heel of these zealots, I'm ready to extract a little blood. Um, where'd she go? Some traps would be nice. Traps? Well, fine. I guess I could put down some traps, whatever, if you want. Shall we prepare a little surprise for them? I'll set this here. Where am I going? Here they are. Let's make it hurt, shall we? I see no one. Hey, Lloyd, stop dropping over stuff. Oh, here they come. Set off my traps. I guess we're not hitting my traps. Yeah, there goes one of them. Where are they? Do they honestly think we'll let them win? I'm not hardly seeing anybody. So just the three of them? Kill the coldest of machines. Okay. Nice. What else you got? Is that it? No, there's more people up here. Okay. Keep that for later. I feel pretty good about that. That was not so tough.
Alright, give me back my trap. Didn't use half of them. Is that it? Is that all we got coming? So if that's all they got, that was just too easy. I don't wanna jinx it, but we might be in the clear. Oh, you jinxed it. A bit late, aren't we, gentlemen? Sorry, ma'am. The boat's waiting. Damn, I spoke too soon. This one's mine. Get to the boat. You know, this time I think I might be out of my league. If anything happens to her, I will be very cross. We're not going anywhere. We got a, we got a machine. Uh, Thunderjaw? Corrupted Thunderjaw. Let's take off this. Get out of my face, dude. Whoa, that's not a permanent rock. Nor is that. Ah, damn it. Why do I always hit the wrong button when I have that disc monster in my hand? Would you hold still? For God's sakes. Got it. Can't have that. Let this launcher go. That hurt him. Here's the other one. That's not it. Hey, 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 hey.
Yeah, have some bombs to the face. I lost my Karja archers, that's probably not a big surprise. I didn't even take any damage on that. <laughs> Alright dude, what you got? Some coils, Thunderdaw lands. Alright, pretty good. All right, very good. Some metal shards. There's the weapon. Okay. Um, we are meant to go to the shore now. Which is where. It wasn't so bad. The Thunder Jaws don't really intimidate me. They're... Once you take down their, their disc launchers, it's not that bad. I'm actually more afraid of rock breakers and storm birds than I am thunder jaws. Even a corrupted thunder jaw. Because you can stay out of their attack range. They're too slow to really hit you. Alright, it's done. Where's the boat? Not exactly a royal barge, is it? Oh well, defectors can't be choosers. Let's get aboard, shall we? You guys get aboard. I'm staying here. I guess I'm not staying here. Oh, come on, I wanted to get that flower. Not the flower, the vantage point. That's all right. We unlocked the campfire. I can fast travel back there. You've done a good thing. Maybe even ended a war. Maybe. But my war just keeps going. Not for too much longer, Aloy. Not for too much longer. Look at that, we made it to Meridian. You have nothing to fear. You are now under the protection of the Sundom. My protection. As is your mother, she will not be harmed. You have my word, the law of the sun. Aloy, it seems I see your influence everywhere. You've done so much for the Sundom, and it will always be appreciated. You have my thanks. May you walk in the light. Sweet! Is that the end of the quest? Should be. Appalling. I spent two years in the Forbidden West setting this up and the redhead gets <laughs> all the credit? I'm still getting paid, right? You'll be lucky if I let you live. I couldn't have done this without you. When we meet again, I'll give you a proper thanks. I promise. Yeah. A woman atop the Hunter's Lodge? Never thought I'd see that sunrise. Queen's Gambit completed. 
Well guys, that is it. That is the final, almost the final side quest in the game. Not counting the DLC and also not counting Ancient Armory for which I just need to pick up another, uh, what do you call it, another, um, they did the defectors. Uh, I need to pick up another power cell. Um, there's nothing really to that. That's There are no more side quests in the game. That's it. So, um, we're in Meridian. Uh, I'm going to zip back over here. Very nice. Um, what was in these boxes? Oh, the health this yeah. I would like to try and grab that vantage point while we're here. Which is going to be totally the other direction from what I was looking at. Overdosing at Wyatt's cottage, I went out walking along the water. I was standing right here when the idea hit me. And the moment it did, I knew I had to do it.
sand in my throat. Burns. All right, well, I guess we'll have to, s to call it here. Um, we did pick up another skill point. That's good. Um, that's pretty awesome. Um, we got some new treasure boxes. Maybe we should take care of some of this. Lots of wire. Parkers, Blaze. All good stuff. Wow. We had a lot of boxes. Large machine core. <laughs> My resource satchel is full. Okay, very good. Um, let's take a look at our notebook and see how, how we did today. Uh, 92.88, so we went up about a percent. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Not too shabby. Alright guys, let's go ahead and save the game here. In the next episode, I'm going to go get that vantage point. Alright, very good. Um, yeah, we're going to stop here, gang. Uh, let me take a minute to thank my patrons. My $5 plus patrons are Michael Hilliard and Mythos Irving. My $3 plus patrons are listed in the description below, along with any links that they've requested that I link to. Please do go check that out. Good stuff in there, guys. And then finally, at the end of this episode, you're going to see a list of all my $1 plus patrons. Thank you very much, guys. It is much appreciated. Without your support, this would be a much more difficult endeavor, so I do appreciate the help. Okay, gang, we're going to stop here, and we will pick this back up in the next episode. So I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot. Thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please take a second to comment, like, and subscribe. All these things really help me out. I'd like to say a big thanks to all my patrons whose names are appearing on the screen right now. Thanks a lot, guys. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more great content, consider joining my list of patrons. There's a link on the screen in the bottom left corner. Thanks a lot, guys, and I'll see you in the next video.